there's this criticism that's leveled against, and I think it's kind of contrary in and of itself. On the one hand, you know, they accuse us of wanting to turn back the clock to the good old days of the 1950s. We're so unrealistic. We want to go back to the 50s. Turn back the clock. Go back. Don't go forward and all of this sort of thing. Back to the days when the Catholic Church told everybody what to do, when to do, and how to do, and so forth. Never really why to do it, though. Just do it! Because you're Catholics and you're not supposed to use your brain. That whole thing. Of course, this is we reject this on its face, if I can do a brief tangent. We have a column at the Remnant newspaper called Lost in the 50s 2, which was written by my father back in the 1950s. And it's a remarkable column because it shows that things were just about as bad back then as they are now. You know, maybe not quite as bad, not quite as crazy in the streets, but it wasn't, <laughs> it wasn't uh, utopia. It wasn't Christendom in the 1950s America. So we don't even accept that going back to the 50s would solve the problem anyway. <laughs>